the top five hidden base locations on Shinaris and DayZ. So before we jump into the video, make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe because I do post DayZ content every single week. So if you guys would do that for me, that would be very appreciated. These are some base locations that I would build my base at on Shinaris. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. The first spot is going to be at this log cabin right below Tricresta. So this is a wonderful base location and I will tell you guys why. So first of all, this house is in the middle of nowhere okay that's the first thing the second thing is is that it has a greenhouse right behind it so if you guys want to grow some fruits and vegetables you are able to do that and it's also right below tricresta which is a military checkpoint and it is decently close to tizzy which is also one of the biggest military checkpoints in the game and you are able to put like three to four layers in the log cabin and you can probably put maybe three on the outside so you can have a decent amount of layers and a lot a lot of people don't even check this building. The next base location is going to be at this building right beside Seznovka, right above Zelenogorsk. Now, I don't know why, but I didn't know this building was right here. Like, I literally found out it was here like 30 minutes ago. So first, it's in a pretty decent location. You have Zeleno right below you, which that city does have a military checkpoint. And Zeleno is a awesome city to find building supplies in. And if you guys didn't know this, down here near Zeleno, this is where all the helicopter crashes happen like this is where most of them are so that's another good thing and another good thing about this base location is this house is kind of away from everything and around this structure is pretty flat so you guys will be able to put a decent amount of layers around it now the next base location is going to be in the woods right next to Kozlovka now there's a lot of things that I could say about the space location but the first thing I'm gonna say is that it's pretty close to the coast so if you guys do die you can get back to your base decently fast. And like I said, it is right next to Cherno, which is a wonderful spot to get base boning supplies at. And another good thing about that is there's a military checkpoint right beside Cherno. So you also have that to loot and you also have Bloda. Like there's a whole bunch of good stuff near Cherno. And just to let you guys know, not a lot of people build here because not a lot of people know about this location. Now guys, when I say you can build a lot of layers, I mean you can build a lot of layers. I built here like, I think like a year ago i put like a lot of layers right here like over 10 at least like this spot is really flat so you can really build a lot of watchtowers and really build a lot of fences the next base location is going to be at this log cabin at we all know it can be wobo now if you guys do build here you can have your own little island how cool is that now again this base is decently close to the coast so if you guys do die you can get back pretty quick now the one thing that i really like about this spot is that the ground is really flat around it so that means you can build a lot around it like watchtowers fences whatever you want to build you can build it and there's many more buildings in can be wobo and electro that you guys can loot the next base location is going to be at this barn right above of Cine stock now guys just to let you know i could say a lot more things about these base locations but i really don't want this video to be that long now one really good thing about this base location is that the ground is really flat so that means you guys can build a fat base and the one good thing about these barns is that they have a decent amount of room in them so you guys can put down tents pretty much whatever you want so that means you guys will have a lot of storage in your base if you guys get lucky and you do find some large tents or pretty much whatever now another fantastic fantastic thing about this spot is that it's near tizzy which has tier 4 loot that is going to be it for this video if you guys haven't already make sure to join my discord the link to my discord is going to be in the description and it's also going to appear on the top right of your screen so if you guys do have any base suggestions that i can use in my future base videos leave them in the comment section below thank you all for watching i really appreciate it though for real everybody have a good day everybody take it easy everybody be safe and i'll see you guys in the next daisy video peace so I hop so in the pool. It's crazy how they watch a young nigga go move.